Hello my fellow Kenyans, I'm Gakonga the coach and the pioneer of Vision Total Football Kenya. Barizen wa Kenya wenzangu. Number one, I want to thank everyone because I have just returned from Kenya and I want to thank everyone who I came across and those who have been supporting Vision Total Football Kenya through the media. And I must say thank you to Kameme TV for airing Vision Total Football Kenya and a lot of people already know about Vision Total Football Kenya Jameni watu wengi and so many people at the grassroots are willing to support Vision Total Football Kenya so together we are getting stronger and stronger every day even I want to thank politicians who have uh, who have uh, shown a lot of interest in Vision Total Football Kenya because they really understand Vision Total Football Kenya is going to benefit Kenya and the Kenyan youths and vision total football kenya it is going to make football kenyan football become what it should have become years ago so everyone wa kenya wenzangu to support vision total football kenya ndio itakuwa futa kenya and the football economy will drive kenyan economy yeah sports economy is something we must take advantage of so wa kenya wenzangu once again i'm back in uk i'm going to continue working on vision total football kenya so that we can use Vision Total Football Kenya to rescue our Kenyan football. At the grassroots, the support is so huge. I have met a lot of people who are actually struggling, running their own clubs and leagues all over the place without any help from the Football Federation. This is a fact. I have been to Malindi, Kilifi, Lamu, Mombasa, Kiambu, Kote uko ni metembea, and I was in Kajiado last time. So the problem is common. The problem is the same wa Kenya wenzangu. So I want to stop blame games. And what I want to do is that we focus on vision total football Kenya so that our football can be rescued. Yeah, Holistic approach is required to rescue Kenyan football. I keep saying our Kenyan football require a new start. What we have is a bonus. Let us have a new fresh start, which I call ushering in a new era for football. Kenya wenzangu another thing i want to talk about is self interest yeah there's a lot of selfish people in kenyan football and that creates self interest yani watu ambao every time i talk about vision they want to know what are they are they going to gain as individuals yeah there are people out there trying to divert the vision so that it helps them and i keep saying no 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 Vision Total Football Kenya is going to help every Kenyan wa Kenya wenzangu. I'm going to say no to anyone who's going to come with an idea that is going to help him and his colleague or whatsoever. I want Vision Total Football Kenya to help everyone in Kenya, no matter which corner of the country someone is based, no matter which county you are, you live in, Mandera, Bomet, Wajir, Lamu, Kiambu, Nairobi, wherever you are, you are going to benefit from Kenyan football because that is what it is lacking in Kenyan football. A lot of self-interest, a lot of conflict of interest, but that all of that will be eliminated by Vision Total Football Kenya. We need, we need to see the bigger picture. We need to see further. We need to stop being... Uh, we need to stop being blinded and just caring about our own self and our own interest. Let us work together as a nation let us embrace each other let us every time we do something let us do something that will benefit all of us as kenyans yeah self-interest is killing kenyan football this conflict of interest corruption here and there this is all about selfishness yeah let us all together see what we can do for the nation the country kenya that we love so much let us create a better football for generations to come let us create a better football for our children some some people like me and many other we have yeah we are victims of kenyan football a lot of opportunities have uh, have gone away we have not benefited from the kenyan football but right now using vision total football kenya we can we can correct the errors we can co correct the mistakes of the past so that the future generations will not suffer from kenyan football as we are today and i'm talking about a period of five years we will see mega benefits in our kenyan football yeah i have met a lot of people who are playing football but at the grassroots also but they don't know where they will go next where they need to go next yeah we must create opportunities within our football leagues yeah the professional league the semi professional so that they can move on it is such it is it, you know it is sad to see people who are talented just playing at the grassroots and they never progress this is what i want us to eliminate but only vision total football can will put the correct structures so that every 
person can benefit. And I want to mention something here about the pastoralist communities. Uh, if Vision Total Football Kenya is implemented, we are going to require about 1 million balls in Kenya. And that translate, translate, yeah, that will bring in a 2.7 billion Kenya shilling to the pastoralist community who are going to rear cows for, for the scheme that is going to make uh, the balls. Yeah? And in addition to that, they are going to sell meat to Kenya Meat Commission commission or wherever else they need to sell the meat so that can go you know the pastoralist community can generally yeah can generally get an income yeah a total income of uh, three to four billion kenya shilling just from football alone that is just one area there are so many areas that football is going to benefit like i keep saying kenya should be getting at least annually 125 billion kenya shilling from sports that will not happen if we continue focusing on self-interest conflict of interest let us open our football let us open our football completely so that proper proper sponsors sponsors who can put real money in kenyan football can come and invest in kenya once again oh everyone is a soldier I want to thank everyone individually for supporting Vision Total Football Kenya and please preach the gospel so that so many people can understand Vision Total Football Kenya. Misunderstanding can create, uh, you know, can create bad things. For example, people thinking that I want to take, I want to take out Nick Mwendo. I want to become the FKF chairman and so on. I said I'm not after self-interest. I'm not after self-gain. I want to help the Kenyan football system so that whoever is elected will, will manage a massive organization that is profitable. That's where we must go. Wakenya Wezangu, I'm back in England, but behind the doors, I'm developing other areas that, uh, that are required by Vision Total Football Kenya. So like I said, we have achieved so much together and the journey continues. I will be back in Kenya again very soon in in just a few months time to continue with where we left. But when I'm not in Kenya, I'm continuing here to build what Vision Total Football Kenya need. Like I keep saying, we still have a work to do. Some people are wondering why we terminated the work, but it is as a result of strategic planning. So I can promise you that we have achieved so much together and very soon our Kenyan football is going to be rescued. I leave you in peace. I'm gone. Once again, I'm Gakonga, the coach and the pioneer of Vision Total Football Kenya. I thank you all. I thank you all again. And I want to say, let us work together for the benefit of our country, Kenya. I leave you in peace. Now I'm gone.